Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be a what I'm currently doing video. So what I'm currently reading, watching and playing. First up for reading, I have The Grace Keepers by Kirsty Logan. I haven't actually started this one because it was sent to me only yesterday by my friend Claire from Paper Wishing Stars. I'm very eager to read it though because it is giving us some serious night circus vibes. Secondly, I'm reading this graphic novel version of The Hobbit. I'm not too far in, but I'm liking it a lot so far. The illustrations are are really fantastic and I quite like how the story has been adapted. And lastly, I'm reading the graphic novel of Full Metal Alchemist. This is one of my all-time favorite animes, so I thought I would give the graphic novel a go. This contains volumes one, two, and three, and even though I've only read a teeny little bit, I'm liking a lot so far. In terms of what I've been watching, I'm mainly watching anime. <laughs> I mean, I'm always usually watching anime, but a sanity store recently opened up in my hometown that sells anime. So I've really been reaping the benefits of being able to purchase anime on DVD. I'm about halfway through the first season of Code Geass which I've been dying to watch for so long and it's so so good. It reminds me a lot of Death Note. I find that Light is really similar to Lulu in that they're both these really super highly intelligent protagonists who have this alter ego that's all for the sake of the good of the people. And I'm also watching the second collection of The Future Diary. This is one of my favorite animes. It's so intense and weird and funny kinda, and I just really, really adore it. Now that's actually all that I'm watching currently because over the last six months, my boyfriend and I have binge watched a ton of different animes. Off the top of my head, we've watched Tokyo Ghoul, uh, Parasite, Miggy is my favorite creature ever, uh, Yona of the Dawn, which is basically the best thing in my life right now. Uh, Claymore, Fate Zero, Fate Stay Night, Unlimited Blade Works, Eden of the East. I watched Fruits Basket because it's so sweet and I love it and funny. And yeah, as for games, I recently finished The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt on the PS4 and guys, this game is so good, it's ridiculous. It really does live up to its hype and everything about it is fantastic. The story is so beautiful, the characters are beautiful and so is the music and you really do get emotionally invested in the story. It reminds me a lot of Lord of the Rings and there was actually this one scene in the game that made me cry and I mean, I was bawling like a baby because it reminded me of a scene from Lord of the Rings so yeah, that was um, pretty embarrassing for all parties involved, i.e. me and my boyfriend. But if you haven't played any of the Witcher games or if you've played the previous two, I definitely recommend the Witcher 3. And lastly on my DS, I've been playing and loving Majora's Mask. I first played Majora's Mask on the 64 and I'd say it's probably my favorite Zelda game. So you can imagine how excited I was when it got re-released on the DS. It can seem a bit daunting and complicated, especially if you haven't played Majora's Mask before, but once you get familiar with the gameplay and the features, you'll be fine. So yeah, that's basically all I've been doing lately. Um, oh, before I forget, I've been meaning to mention this in a video for like the last seven months, but I keep forgetting because I'm a useless human being. I have an Instagram account, so if you have Instagram, you should follow me. My username is avatar, as in avatar the lost airbender. <laughs> So avatar underscore Gabriella, Gabriella as in my name, Gabriella. <laughs> and yeah, let me know what you've been reading or watching or playing and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.